Here we go again. Hey guys, it's Suresh. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning into another video with me today. Today I have another exciting Integrity Toys doll for you guys. She is brand new and she is part of the Fall 2017 Fashion Royalty Collection. So I guess technically this is my very first Fashion Royalty doll. She is Coquette Jordan Duval. She's been here at my place for a hot minute now. I am just so in love with her colors. Um, and her skin tone and her hair and everything about this doll from all the promotional photos that I have seen it looks amazing and magnificent. One of the questions that a lot of you guys have asked me who are not Integrity Toys um, uh, shoppers is, where do I find these dolls? A lot of them are sold out on their website or they just have not been offered on the website and that's true. Um, Integrity Toys does not sell many of their um, new collections on their website, oddly. So you actually have to go to their um, authorized retailer section on their website and buy it from there. Here she is in all of her packing um, and I am pulling her out just like so. I did purchase her from Susan's Shop of Dolls. I will put the link down below in the description box. I am so psyched. Okay, so here is the shipper box. Coquette Jordan Duval Dressed Doll. She's from the La Femme collection for 2017 Fashion Royalty. Oh my God, I can't wait. I am so excited that this is my very first Fashion Royalty doll and what an introduction she will be. Wow, so through the tissue paper here, I can see the Fashion Royalty FR logo. <gasps> Ooh, this is so exciting and let me tell you guys I have had a day and a half so this is just the surprise I need to pep me up a little bit beautiful box here Wow gorgeous black paper box um, with a little bit of a black gloss trim one two three <gasps> oh, Wow <gasps> I mean hello gorgeous Wow she has got a face oh and the little bag oh. <laughs> i am living for every single piece of this beautiful beautiful presentation i love the box i love the little fr logo embossed accessory pouch here i love the way she's tied down with white ribbons absolutely gorgeous we see here in the right hand side corner her little bag is taped down and then i also see the telescoping portion portion of her stand on the left side cute little hands oh my god she has a little tag on that says it fashion royalty on it <laughs> okay you guys let me get started deboxing this beautiful magnificent creature oh how cute are her little feet <laughs> here is the little accessory pack <gasps> her shoes are divine wow i love this color how beautiful it is like a gorgeous gorgeous um leaf green color absolutely beautiful so gorgeous they look like they are beautiful stiletto sandals with some satin ribbon to help tie them up her ankles i believe wow so gorgeous i love that love that love that love that and then we have her little jewelry set oh my god look at that little ring it's a little orange flower <gasps> and her beautiful earrings again all this stuff is so lifelike like it literally looks like it could be a human accessory pack and then i see her gorgeous necklace here wow beautiful orange beads with some little bronzy gold beads um, it looks like it has a little s clasp closure absolutely love that it's all on what appears to be a pink color backing absolutely beautiful it's a big bold necklace which y'all know i live for and then last but not least we have her alternative handset um, these look like holding hands um, so I believe that's to hold her beautiful little purse here gorgeous I love this manicure color oh <gasps> living she actually is limited to 725 pieces um, and she's distributed through all of their authorized retailers so I'll put the link down below um, to the integrity sites um, authorized retailer page but from there you start basically connecting to uh, through all their authorized retailers and see 
what they have in stock because their um, Jessie's new La Femme collection has been very, very popular. And I have noticed as I was looking for her that many places are sold out. I believe I will probably pull this out from the back. Yep, here we go. Exposes us to all of her trappings. Oh, wow, cool. And here is her certificate of authenticity right there in the back. Um, COQ 145 of 725. Oh, how cool is that? She's tied down with silk white ribbons and the similar um, insets and holders that I saw at the Heart MLP collection. Oh my gosh, here is my absolute favorite clear stand that you guys are always asking what stands I use on my dolls. And here we go, this is what I use. I remember Jesse telling me that the entire La Femme collection is based off of the south of France and the Mediterranean. This is literally me. This is me, actually, this is me. Um, there really is no ands, ifs, or buts about it. This is absolutely me. I love turquoise. I actually call it turquoise just to have a little bit of bougie about me. <laughs> One, two, and three. <gasps> Yay! Here is the telescoping portion of the stand. Um, I will definitely be, be taking this out because y'all know that I love me a fashion royalty doll stand. Okay. Oh, wow. She does have a white hairnet on, which you know I will be taking off. <gasps> wow. Just at quick glance, her bustier is beautifully constructed. Oh my gosh. It looks like it's lined fully. <gasps> And there are little, uh, what appear to be hook and eyes. Oh my gosh, her little hands. Wow. Oh, this girl is everything. Every, everything. And her gorgeous overskirt really is not that wrinkled. So that's nice. I, lo I love and I appreciate that. Wow. It's like fully, fully lined. She does have plastic wrapped around her knees. And I have learned that they do that so that their knees don't... Um, bend in transit yes darling when i was in monaco years ago it was just exquisite it really was all right so let's go ahead and take her hair net off um i'm gonna be very gentle very careful here <gasps> wow her hair is so pretty oh my god the colors oh i see a beautiful sculpted cat eye here silver eyeliner very neutral shadows and a gorgeous slim brow uh, I see the gorgeous hand applied lashes here. Really sweet and simple earrings here, um, edged in gold. And uh, the necklace, again, is just, just darling. It's so beautiful. It goes so beautifully with her skin and with this gorgeous turquoise color. Love the little ring. I put it on her right hand pointer finger. I absolutely adore her little handbag here. It reminds me um, of a few different Fendi bags put together, um, sort of like their Peekaboo and a few of their shoppers put together to kind of make this beautiful piece. Um, it has a gorgeous little gold hardware to it and it does open as well. Oh my God. And the inside is just beautifully lined. Oh wow. Her shoes here. Oh, you guys are just gorgeous. I love the juxtaposition of this kind of leaf green with the turquoise. Um, I find it to be such an interesting combination and I think it's so beautiful. The shoes are so beautifully sewn, so nicely finished off. This gorgeous silk ribbon adds such a nice touch to it. Um, I will say, I feel like the ribbon could be a little bit shorter. I found it to be quite long as I was wrapping it around her ankles here. Here is Miss Gorgeous Jordan Duval in the buff so that you guys can take a better look at her fantastic physique here. She does have a very sophisticated body, I will say. It's different from the Heart MLP doll that I recently reviewed, and it's also different than the New Face Girls that Jesse introduced me to when he was here at my place. She is articulated at the shoulder here, at the elbow, just like so, at her wrist. And these are the original hands that she came with. Um, and then she is articulated underneath the bust here, just like so, that gives her range of motion. Her head does move up, down, side to side as well. And she has the very exaggerated um, clavicles here, which is fabulous. IMO. She does have a very small waist, um, which looks beautiful in clothes, obviously. Not realistic, but however, let's keep in mind, this is a doll. It doesn't always have to be realistic. There is her cute little belly button, and her legs are articulated um, at the knee here, and then here at the hip. Um, they are jointed the same way the Heart MLP doll was. 
um, with the little plastic ball joints and then her feet are absolutely beautiful they are a very high arch and they have a little pink pedicure um, the same color as her manicure color which i love appears to be the same color as her lipstick as well here is her gorgeous body from the back just beautiful i love the joints and um, how seamless they appear on the body here is her sweet little bustier it is absolutely gorgeous it's constructed of a beautiful camel faux leather there is a lot of top stitching here going on um, there are two darts right here at the bust there is a center seam there are two full panels right underneath the bust here so there are multiple little pieces coming together to make this i love so much the sweetheart neckline is also beautiful um, and then when you turn it around you can see that there are two more panels back here just absolutely gorgeous and then look at the inside here i mean this <laughs> literally could be a full human size ensemble i love that um, and then there is her little IT label, so cute. The lining is also very soft, it's beautiful. Appears to be a polyester silk uh, lining, which is standard. Absolutely love, how beautiful are these hooks? Wow, they're so high fash and sophisticated looking. And they fall into little um, thread loops here. And then there is also a little facing here, which is so beautiful. Here are her beautiful little trousers. I absolutely love these so much. Um, they are a gorgeous silk. They feel very nice to the touch. There are two colors in here, um, a beautiful turquoise color and then a sea blue color next to it, all separated with this kind of um, off-white cream colored line. Um, there are little pockets in the trousers. How freaking cute. And they are lined, amazing. Um, there is a side seam going all the way down the trouser and then it is cuffed here at the bottom. Very sophisticated. I, there is no waistband, um, but it fits her beautifully. And then here in the back, there are two little darts here on either side. And there is a little facing here as well so that when you open the closure, um, you don't see inside right away, which is very sophisticated. And then when you look inside, wow, gorgeous. There is an IT tag right there and the same gorgeous fastenings that we saw in the bustier as well with the little thread loop details and the pants are fully fully lined um, they go all the way down so that is a gorgeous detail absolutely love that again if you zap these in um, a real size machine they would be legit human pants and i am obsessed here's her gorge gorge overskirt it is the most beautiful shade of turquoise and the most gorgeous soft silk. I am just obsessed with this so, so much. Um, on the front side, there's a beautiful panel that goes down the bottom that kind of creates a point of interest. I love the way it's sewn together, so neatly done. And then the waistband is gathered beautifully and evenly and has one simple waistband here. On the underside, you can see that there is a thicker band, kind of giving it some more support and structure. And the inside is fully lined. Look how beautifully these seams are finished off. Like you can't see anything. This is like real couture, let me tell you kids. This reminds me very much of a recent Fendi collection. They did this beautiful overskirts that went over trousers and uh, little dresses and I am just so gaga for this piece. How beautiful. And then look at the fastening. It's the same exact gorgeous um, hook that we saw in the trousers and the bustier and a sweet little thread loop right there. So there we have it, you guys. This is the brand new gorgeous coquette Jordan Duval doll for the 2017 La Femme collection for fashion royalty. Congrats, Jessie Ayala. She's a gorgeous doll and I'm so proud to have her. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I hope that you learned something. Be sure to give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Make sure to hit that little bell icon after the subscribe button. That way you guys are notified every Thursday when I upload a new video. Add me on Instagram. I am at Suresh and why that's generally where I post all my updates and until I see you guys again Jordan and I are gonna head on over to the Brooklyn Botanical Gardens Dawling there is a fabulous cocktail party happening tonight and we are the guests of honor of course wherever you guys are in the world I hope you're having a fantastic day big hugs and kisses for me and Jordan here in New York Mwah! and I'll see you guys again next Thursday for another video okay bye